Um, the Gateway Promise Program is an assurance that high school seniors who qualify will get three years of free tuition at Gateway Technical College. It's really a way to not only make college affordable, but also attainable through the intrusive type of support that we give those students. Gateway was established in 1911. And in, in fact, it was the first institution of its type in the state of Wisconsin, and the first state-supported technical college in the country. And we really make uh, life-changing educational opportunities are a reality. And we do that through 73 technical diplomas and associate degrees. The largest program that students are going into from our Promise program is our nursing program. Uh, 35 of those 165 students that we had in our first cohort are actually going into nursing. The health patient simulator lab that we built on the Kenosha campus to support nursing especially, but our, all of our other health programs, certified nursing assistant, uh, EMT, even uh, fire. Uh, it helps uh, them get a simulation that they can't get uh, out in the field. I see nothing but growth in Kenosha County and it's because of public-private partnerships that have been growing and growing in this area. For example, we have great partnership with Kenall and Snap-on, just to name a couple of them. Uh, and these kinds of partnerships actually help strengthen uh, the vitality of the county. Uh, if you think about one of uh, our partnerships we've had for a very long time is with CABA and KUSD to build Lakeview Technology Academy. And now it's one of the highest achieving high schools in Kenosha Unified. I think the greater impact is going to be an increase in the number of college educated degree people in our region. And I think that speaks to the quality of life that we have and the possibilities of uh, occupations and what fields those uh, folks can go into. Uh, I think it also uh, lifts the economy. They all be contributing to the economy. And we think it also, when you think about business and industry, if they want to relocate or build or expand uh, in, in Kenosha County, they'll have a steady pipeline of graduates and skilled workers who are ready for those high demand jobs.